up YouTube. Thank you for joining me um, on this lovely evening in October. Um, literally five days till Halloween. And with that in mind, my loot crate has arrived. Loot crate. Um, so loot crate unboxing. And this month's uh, theme is Halloween. And uh, it's really, it's falling into, sorry, sorry my eye. Uh, it's falling into um, a really good set of dates. So five days from Halloween, a day after The Walking Dead season seven premiere. Oh my God. Um, literally, the cat I shit out yesterday, he's doing really well, if anyone was interested. Um, he's, he was shocked also, um, but he's, he's eating and he's uh, all snuggled up next door. I won't show you him because I don't want to disturb him, but, uh, yeah, um, enough of that rubbish. So the loot crate. Now, the first thing I, I, I thought when I saw this was, this is a tiny loot crate. This is a very, very... Oh, look, a dress. Try if you can get that. It's a very, very little loot crate. And um, I thought they're not going to be able to pack much in it. Sadly for me, this is the last loot crate I'm getting for a while because I actually do have to save up for a wedding. So I love you, loot crate. And if you want to sponsor me, I'll carry on opening boxes. But not necessarily playing for him. Well, I don't know if that works. Um, but without further ado, let's uh, let's crack into this and see what we've got. I'm a real big fan of Halloween. I like skulls, and um, I'm not going to say I like death because well, I just did. But the concept. Ah, wow. Okay. Well, I knew that already because I watched it yesterday. The, the top of the box, without showing you too much, tells me when The Walking Dead Season 7's back out. Um, there it is, and there's all the guys in front of Negan. And straight away, Walking Dead carries on. The theme carries on. I've got this piece of uh, elastic. Very Halloween-inspired, very scary. Um, the T-shirt, which... <coughs> I'm so happy to have, seriously, for my last t-shirt, it's the best t-shirt I've got. It's a baseball style, and again in fat boy size, says the Nagan Sluggers. Now guys, uh, please, if you wish, um, correct me on how I'm saying it. I say Nagan, um, but there is no A in it, so it is Negan, but it's just the way I talk. Um, there he is. But the swing is pat looking literally looking like the psychopath that he is and if you watched last night's episode and you were as excited and awestruck as I was also one of these sections up here whichever one I decide to put it on um I, I had a review and reaction review and uh it's where I gave birth to my shit cat so please watch that because that would be awesome but this is lovely and it's dark I've had a lot of light grey t-shirts. This is the Robocop one. Uh, grey. Uh, I had a blue one. I've only had five loot crates. Um, and I, I, I am dreadfully sorry that I can't carry it on. But uh, I will pick it back up. I will re renew my subscription after Christmas and things are out of the way. Um, until then, I have kept my Halo legendary crate. Because, again, massive Halo fan. So let's float that down. Look at the size of that. For any of you who don't know what a fat man is, it's that. Happy days. Next thing in the crate, and I saw this um, wicked, wicked thing. It's like a flag banner. And it says, Camp, Crystal, Lake. Uh, and that's um, Jason Voorhees, um, his thing. So Friday the 13th. Um, that's gonna go. That's going to adorn my wall. Lovely. Yeah, it's very nice. Um, there's a game coming out, a Friday the Thirteenth game, very soon, uh, where you get to be Jason, 
and kill a bunch of people. Um, I just will do that in real life. Not be Jason, I mean kill people. Don't tell anyone. Oh wow, oh that's cute. Yeah. <clears throat> Another really well known horror franchise. I'll get it out of the bag instead of showing plastic. And then I'll throw the plastic. It's Leatherface from the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. It's a, it's a funny doll. Kid Robot. Oh, it's a Necker. Oh, it's all Necker. They've got their hands in every doll pie. It's got little, funny little legs. And he looks a little bit like a squid. Because he's got like a squid beak. But he's got a little tie. Oh, look, he's got a little tie. There you go. I'd like to tuck that in. Can I? No. His apron's actually a separate piece of material. So let's get that in there. Doesn't look like so much of a tie anymore. Just looks like a random black thing, so. Leather face. Happy days. Where shall I put you, leather face? I'll put you there. No, I'll put you there. For that. Next up, a book. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the thing after that is wicked. Um, so let's do the book. This is called The Legion of Regrettable Supervillains, featuring the 50 strangest supervillains in the history of comics, the Luke Crate edition by John Morris, nevertheless. I love a bit John Morris. Um, so... Uh, this is very cool. Lots of old artwork. Lots of random comic book artwork. And it tells you who the, the good guy was, if you like. Uh, versus who the bad guy was in there. Spider-Man's in here. Not as a bad guy, but he's in here. Let's uh, see if I notice any other characters. That looked like Squidworth. From Spongebob. Spider-Man was on the back. There he is. When he fought the swarm. Um, this, I don't, oh, it's not horror related. It's very cool. Um, I suppose some bad guys are horrible. Um, that's where the, the word come from, Latin, for hor horrible locutus. Um, that's cool though. That, that is actually really nice. Hard Hardback. Nice green cover to cover it's just really weird bad guys um so i get the idea that it's bad guys but super villains maybe should have been in the anti-hero box that would have been wicked it's still very nice thank you i love a book this this beer this is wicked uh, actually should we do it the other way around yeah no. <laughs> oh cool this month's pin, and it's a, that happens to be, oh, sorry, lighting. Um, Michael Myers and his pumpkin motif, Mike Myers. Um, so, Halloween, from Halloween, that's quite right. Uh, I do like a bit of Mike Myers. Another one of the infamous horror movie uh, bad guys. Um... That mask, just in case you don't know, William Shatner's face. So William Shatner mask. I'm sure most of you do know that by now. And this bit, I saw this, and I've made funny little <laughs> noises twice now. But this, this, this is wicked. Let's go that way. There's Freddy. What could Freddy possibly be doing in Loot Crate? And we all know Freddy has got a glove with knives on it for fingers. And this is what this is. Chopsticks. Yes. Now, being a fat man, and I know I, I say that a lot, I know I like to poke fun at myself because if you can't poke fun at yourself, who the fuck you get? No, actually, I poke fun at lots of people. This is, uh, they're meant to look like his, his blades. These are very long. He's not trimming these ones down. And then in the back there, it's quite a detail. This is a nice rubber. Nice little detail on it. Nice, uh, oh, wrong side. Um, 
But that, look at that. I can't use chopsticks for shit. Well, I can. Depends on what mood I'm in. I.e. lazy fat eating or expert food consumer. But these will come in very handy. In fact, I'm going to eat my sandwich with these. Uh, because not many people eat sandwiches with chopsticks. And I, I believe it might be a sandwich. Yes. Um, that is very cool. Kind of floppy. <laughs> oh, right. Moving on. This month's uh, book. There we go. That's uh, the back. And that's the front. That's the spine. Um, this is the other noise I made. <laughs> noise at. Um, so I'll show you very quickly. And in fact, if I am so brave, I am brave. Come on now. Let me very quickly. If this is going to. I suppose I can edit this. Um, bit out. Where I'm making a fool of myself. It's taking some. There we go. It's taking some effort. To, to do this. Effort is a good thing. Oh, lots of effort. <laughs> Completely raping the box to do this. In my first uh, two loot crates, the box was a diorama. The third one, the box was my third one. No, three, I've had six, so the first three were dioramas. Um, then the fourth one was a Harlequin hammer. The fifth one turned into a little car. And uh, this one uh, is... Jesus, wept. He did indeed. He wept for a very long time. Oh, that's how you make a mess of a box. Damn it, man! I've just knocked my cigar over, and subsequently my ghost. Okay. Pop out the. No, I'll leave the eyes. String ting. In. Little piece of rubber. In. Left hand side. In. Walking dead mask. On. I can't see fuck all because I'm not popped out the eyes. Pop out one. <laughs> yeah! Uh, when I was a kid, zombies were interested in eating brains. That actually looks like my right eye. Look at that. <coughs> brains. That's all they used to do. Um, now they can run, uh, pick up guns. It's crushing my nose. But get back to the review uh, in the zombie face uh, thank you so much for watching like and subscribe um, as I said I've got a video <laughs> my head looks massive my head is usually quite big but this is making it even bigger I've got a video on AMC's uh, sorry let's not take the piss The Walking Dead last night um, so please watch that I will have a review of ooh, I'm gonna eat my old hand I'm going to um, do a review of Doctor Strange tomorrow. I said that yesterday, but I'll do it tomorrow. A um, little recap. T-shirt. Zombie mask. Book. Chopsticks. Huh. And Leatherface doll. It looks like squid. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, this is my last loot crate for a while. Um, not that any of you actually give a flying rat bollocks. Um, but uh, please, yeah, like and subscribe. It's, it would be really nice.
if you did that. I mean, I would really like some subscribers. Um, so, yeah. Love ya. Bye.